What is up everybody? How are you doing? My name's Axel, those of you who don't know. And for today's video, I think it's about time that we prank my mum. So before we get into the video guys, I'm feeling a little bit ill, my nose feels a little bit blocked, so please ignore the fact that I probably sound a little bit weird. But for today's video, as I've said already, we're going to be pulling a little prank on my mum. And it's really hot in here guys, I'm wearing grey, and I think I'm going to get sweat patches. Just ignore that. So a couple of weeks ago, I went on Amazon and ordered the most realistic looking tattoo I could find on the website. I came across this design and the image of someone actually wearing it or having the tattoo on looked really, really real. So I thought I'd get this one. You guys can't actually see that because of the light. I got this one. It's like a fish. It's got like flowers and like seaweed. I, I don't know. So basically for today's video, I'm pranking my mum by telling her that I got a fake tattoo. So because I ordered the tattoos a few weeks ago, from that point on, I've been telling my mum almost every single day that I really want a tattoo. For those of you who don't know, I'm 17 and my mum really made it clear that she really didn't think I should get one. She spoke about things like I'd regret it because it's something that you have for the rest of your life, that obviously I was too young to get a tattoo, that she really didn't want me to get a tattoo, and just other reasons in general as to why my mum doesn't want me getting a tattoo. The problem is for her guys, I am getting a tattoo, but what she doesn't know is the tattoos completely fake. Sorry mum. So I had no idea they were going to send more than one tattoo and I was actually getting quite worried when they were coming down thinking to myself that if I made a mistake that's it that'll be the end of the video. But luckily I do have more than one so if I mess up I can try again. So obviously because these tattoos are fake these are just the ones that you apply with water. I think they last about 10 weeks which is really really good and as I said the guy that was wearing it on the photo on the internet it looked really really real so I chose to go with these. I've got a big pan of water here and I also watched this tutorial a few weeks ago and apparently if you apply it with a sponge it goes down a lot better. So I guess without further ado let's get this tattoo on. I have no idea how it goes but luckily I've got a few more so if it goes wrong that's not a problem. Right. Gonna open it up. I don't want to mess up. I just want to get it done first time making it look real as hell Okay, so before I put it on here's the tattoo guys. That is it in detail if you want to have a look I don't know. It's a cool design. Let's apply it guys. Okay, so I have to start off by peeling off this little thing here Oh, that's so Satisfying the fish is there. I'm gonna put the tattoo right there. That's it. There's no going back Luckily, it's fake. So if I change my mind, I can just wash it off. I'm gonna wet my sponge now and I guess I'm just gonna I genuinely think this first one isn't going to go that well and that's why I'm so happy that I've got other ones to try it with. How do I know if it's ready? That's what it looks like so far guys. I have no idea how to know whether it's ready or not. I want to make sure it just looks so real. Okay guys, so I wasn't happy how the first one turned out and I just went and scrubbed it off before it dried out. But I kind of get the hang of it now and I know exactly what I have to do. So let's go for my second try. My arms are looking really red now, but it's actually quite good because it's going to make it look like the tattoo is real and I've actually been poked by needles a thousand times. Take two, let's go, let's put it on and hopefully the tattoo is going to look real. This one's started off well, it's all nice and flat, nice and straight. I'm going to do this so carefully and get it perfect. Perfect guys. Some more water. Okay guys, so for the reveal in three, two, one, go! That looks so real! Oh, what? Guys, look at that! Just need to peel the barcode off, that's not that good. God guys, I'm so excited, look how real that looks! Like, I don't even want a tattoo, I just want to prank my mum, but I genuinely think that looks so good. And the reason I'm so excited guys is because I know for sure this prank is going to go down so well, and my mum's going to freak out. Honestly guys, I'm so so shocked of how it turned out, and when you just look at it, you're like, damn, that kid's hard. The first two fell a little bit just like on the sides because they were like peeling up But this one has turned out so good Oh my god And so guys for this tattoo and this savage prank I want you all to go down there right now and smash that big fat thumbs up button And if you're new to the channel or just haven't done it already I don't know why you wouldn't Smash that big fat red subscribe button and turn on my post notifications So you never miss one of my videos I'm just going to wait for the tattoo to dry out now because I don't want anything to go wrong And then guys after that I've just got a little finishing touch that will make the prank go even better A few moments later And so guys the fake tattoo has been airing out for about 10 minutes now And I think it's ready for the final finishing touch It's going to make my mum absolutely believe it and freak out so Obviously I'm not a very big expert on this I've never had a tattoo I don't really know many people who do have tattoos But I've seen it before where when people get tattoos They get it covered up by like cling film or whatever Just to protect the tattoo Because they've obviously just been needed a thousand times so they need to protect that so what I'm gonna do to make my mum really think the tattoo is real is I'm gonna get some real clean film on my fake tattoo to make my fake tattoo look like a real tattoo and so there you go guys the clean film is now on in my opinion the tattoo looks absolutely insanely real especially in real life I think it doesn't look as real on camera but I'm so happy with how it turned out I was about to speak to you guys but I'm like scared to move my arm in case it ruins everything I want you all to go down there right now and smash that big fat thumbs up button and I want to see you guys smash 50 likes on this video especially if you want to see more 
pranks. And now, of course, we have to wait till my mum comes home. Hopefully, nothing goes wrong with my fake tattoo. And guys, if I die after this video because my mum is so angry and freaks out so much, please, somebody out there, edit this video and post it on YouTube. Just in case I'm not physically able to because my mum beats me that bad. Wish me luck, guys, and let's get into the prank. Also guys, I'm just editing the prank now, and I forgot to mention that in order for the prank to go down well, and for her to actually believe that I'm talking to her, not cameras hidden around the room, I had to film the prank in Portuguese, because that's the language I usually speak to her in, and if I spoke to her in English, that would be quite suspicious. I must admit, the subtitles were a pain to type up, but yeah, that's that guys, and I hope you can still enjoy the prank, just make sure you read the subtitles, so you actually know what's going on. Now let's go into the prank. Mate, and look at her. A few moments later. Esse já tem nenhum conselho. Tipo um peixe, assim umas coisas. Não gostas? Só peguei 150 libras. Mãe, mãe. Não. Não fico chateada. Eu disse que não ia gostar. Mas não. Olha, ainda para lá é grande. Olha, estou desapontada. Para já pensava que era uma coisinha pouquinho. É enorme. Para trabalhar é uma vergonha. Não, mãe! Alex, deixa-me pôr a televisão. Mãe! Deixa-me pôr a televisão. É enorme. Eu também te amo, deixa-me pôr a televisão. Queres que eu te amostre? Não, mas Espera, não. vai pôr a eu... televisão. Não, não. deixa-me. Não tira isso, que isto não se pode tirar. Como é que sabes? Eu sei que eles dizem que não se pode tirar. Mas é que ele está a mostrar. Não mostras quando tiver coisa, não me amostras. Mas o que é que és? Eu quero ver o que é que tu vais Alex. Ser. Respira. Olha o que isto não... Olha já o que fizeste. O que é que fiz? Fizeste só tinta. Isso é para estar com o plástico há um tempo. Esse aqui põe outra vez. Onde é que vais pôr outra vez? Oh, clean film. O que é que achas? Deixa-me secar aqui. Não sei qual é o significado. Não tem significado, é fixe. O que é que achas? Não gosto, filho. Sou-te sincera, não gosto. Mas <risos> mãe... Tu gostas, é tu, é contigo. Eu não gosto. Desculpa que eu... É a minha opinião. É a minha opinião. Sim, mas eu já te tenho idade. E alguém se casa alguma coisa? Well, estás a para dizer que não gostas? Não gosto da tatuagem. Mas não, não é para tu gostar. Para a televisão. Não! Olha! Está bem, Tim. Que, Porquê é que não gostas? Queres que tenha que estar bonito? Sim! Está bonito? Não! Deixa-me pôr a televisão! Não! Por que é que não gostas? Alex, por isso é para tu gostares, não é? Dá-me uma opinião sincera! É grande! Não gosto! Também a querias, pequenina! Isso é para a vida inteira, Alex! Sabes o que é a vida inteira? Mas já está... Faz assim ao corpo todo! Mas já está feita! Não, mãe, deixa-me... Não, mãe, anda cá! Não me enerves que eu vou me enervar! Vá, estás desapontado em mim agora! Estou um bocadinho desapontado! Mãe! Deixa-me pôr a televisão! Deixa-me, senta-te aqui, eu quero falar contigo! Então, põe na televisão e depois já se fala! Põe na televisão! Não, então o que é que achas? É grande! É grande! É enorme! Isto é para uma vida inteira, Alex! Se tu gostas, tudo bem! O corpo é teu! Se tu gostas... Achas que fiz mal? No meu ponto de ver, fizeste! Se tu gostas, é contigo, ok? Agora não podes ir lá tirar la Se tu gostas... Mas mãe, já tenho 17 anos! Alguém te está a dizer alguma coisa? Mãe! O quê? Agora vais dizer que não posso ter tatuagens? Não, faz no corpo todo. Eu quero fazer outra aqui! Pois faz, faz, faz em todo lado. Mas esta bem é grande! Eu ia fazer uma assim deste tamanho! Eu quero, eu quero ter o braço inteiro! Eu pensava que podia confiar em ti. Eu pensava, Alex. Eu pensava que ia ter orgulho. Eu pensava isso. É sério que eu estou a ser sincera, Alex. Eu pensava. E não tens? 
ainda me disse que queres ter o braço inteiro. <risos> mãe, mãe, só porque eu tenho tatuagens não quer dizer que sou boa, má pessoa. Não pode dizer que és má pessoa. Dizeste que não podes ter orgulho em mim. Não, eu estou farto de ir. Estás farto? Estás sempre a dizer mal de ir. Estás farto, vai. Passei o dia todo a fazer isto. Olha, o peixe simboliza a ti porque tu és de peixes. Tu também és de peixes. Eu e tu. Então, vou fazer o braço todo, está bem? Já marquei para a semana que vem, quando eu recebo. Tu não me gostas, Alex. É sério que tu não me gostas. Pois já tenho a Estava a pensar, daqui a, a semana que vem, quando eu receber o braço, ao mês que vem, o outro braço. Quando fizeres isso, quando fizeres outro, agarras nas coisinhas e sais. Não podes viver em casa? Não, não. Não, porquê? Fala com o pai. Não, o pai é isso que nos importa. Então mostra ali logo que diz. Deixa-me pôr a tua visão. Deixa-me pôr a tua visão. Não. Alex, deixa-me pôr a tua visão. Não, não, não. Eu dou-te o abraço daqui a um bocado, sai. De... Alex. Mãe. Alex, sai. Sai. Mãe. Guys, that went so so well. She's falling for it. Oh my god. Sim, mas e ajudo? Então, isto é de ser, vá pôr um bocadinho de estona na, na mão, nisto. Põe um bocadinho de estona aí. Passa aqui. Ah! Põe mais estona. Não há muita força, vai. Vai, deixa, põe um estona e eu faço. Já está cheio. Põe um estona, muito. Tá, 3, 2, 1. It's just a sticker one with water. Yes, and tan grand. Yeah, I'll show you after. What were you thinking when I showed you the tattoo? I don't know. I think it's really. Did you think it was real? Yeah. Uh, it's too big. Too big. And I don't like. It. Come here, give me a hug. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely thought it was time to prank my mom, guys. We finally got her. She was absolutely so angry. Did you guys see? Oh my god. We pranked her. That prank went absolutely insane. I've had my jacket on all day long just so she wouldn't see that the tattoo was there. That was such a long, hard, sweaty prank, but we pranked you. Oh. <laughs> guys, that was one of the best pranks I've ever done. You can just tell she was so, so angry. She doesn't even want to be next to me anymore. She's running away. Come back. Come back. You knew it's Carapalsa. Are you happy that's not real? Yes, I'm happy. <laughs> and I love you. <laughs> I just can't believe how real she thought it was. And for the past like three or four weeks, I've been telling her mm -hmm. that I've wanted a tattoo. But I think you'll be glad to know that I don't actually want a tattoo. Not just yet. Thanks. I don't want a tattoo yet. Maybe in like five years. Smaller one. I don't really want one. I, I'm not bothered right now. We'll see in the future. I think I won't want one, but we'll see. I don't think I want one. Do you want one? No. 
You know she doesn't want one. She was getting so angry. Right, after that, guys, I'm going to give my mum the satisfaction of rubbing it all off because, obviously, we're done with the prank. Right, go on. Every time she was doing it before as well, I was saying it was hurting and she was doing it too hard. But clearly, it just rubs right off. And my mum is now getting so satisfied. I bet you're feeling so relieved. I am. And there it is, guys. The tattoo pretty much absolutely gone. My mum is so happy. And I think we can say that was a successful prank. And so, guys, that was the prank on my mum. How do you guys think it went? Let me know down below in the comments section. I really must admit that throughout the prank I could not help but to laugh. The expression of my mum's face throughout the whole prank was just absolutely hilarious. And every time I looked at her, I just had an incredible urge to start laughing. I do think I pulled myself together quite well. But there are parts in the prank where I can tell that you guys will pick up on me laughing. But honestly, I just really couldn't help it. I must say how cute was my mum at the end when she found out that the tattoo wasn't actually real. She kind of started tearing up and you could tell that she was really, really relieved that the tattoo wasn't actually real. And then afterwards when we came back in, I showed her her reaction and she actually found it really, really funny. And I guess I'm just glad the prank was successful and everything went well and to plan. My mum kind of freaked out and that's what we wanted. But yeah guys, I really hope you all enjoyed the prank. I'm sorry it dragged on for a little bit. I was just trying to get a really good reaction out of my mum. If you did enjoy the prank guys, make sure to go down there right now and smash that big fat thumbs up button. And if it's the first time you're seeing my face on your screen, make sure to go down there right now and smash that big red button. Anyway guys, I'm going to wrap this up now because this video is going to be really, really long. Once again, thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time with another video.